What's up guys, it's Larry the Mortgage Guy Sales Disruptor. Uh, make this real quick. When it comes to your social media, your posting and whatnot, you need to learn to be consistent. Okay, when I say consistency, I mean do what's expected. If you're going to have a live show that you do every single day, try to do it the same time of the day. That way, you build your audience depending on the day and they know to expect to hear from you. If you don't do it consistently, meaning you do it you know, on, on top of the day, you're not going to really build uh, a following for that particular time because you have to understand, we are creatures of habit. People use social media at different times of the day. If I can play this video or do this three times a day, I would. But in reality, I do it when it's convenient for me and therefore hopefully build an audience based on that, right? I also do a, a, a live video when I drop my son off in the morning at school. I have an audience for that. And of course, because it's the same time uh, and people know what to expect, they they, they watch it because they, they want to see what, what happens. And the people who don't like it, they just don't watch it, right? But you gotta learn to be consistent. Now, I'm not telling you to spam. I'm not telling you to, you know, uh, consistently post a bunch of crap or punch, uh, post the same thing over and over and over. What I'm saying is that to learn to time your posts depending on the day and your schedule, okay? Uh, once you learn to be consistent with your posts, you can tweak it, make it better, maybe you know uh, get some feedback from your audience. And if it's something of value, meaning you believe it's a really, really good amount of content that people respond to, then you can always uh, recycle it. You can download the video, you can put it on your page, and then you can post it at a later time, right? Uh, you know, that, that's there's something to be said about recycling or reusing or uh, cloning your content, okay? Uh, hopefully that gave you some value. This is Larry the Mortgage Guy, your sales disruptor. I'm out.